Today we play an amazing Mario Party Superstars game with Reindeer Yoshi versus Evil Yeti Donkey Kong versus Detective Peach versus Penguin Luigi. Who will win? Since Evil Yeti Donkey Kong is really good at this game and really evil, let's see if anyone can win except for him. I hope you enjoy this video. Here we are. These characters are looking amazing. Just have a look at them. Look how good they look. And Horrorland is an absolutely fantastic stage. I definitely don't play this stage enough. Now, where a web might we find a new super? stop maybe it's gonna be one of you's folks do i have to spell it out for you become the superstar and save our forest but now that we're here i got some business to take care of so i'll see you folks later don't you gotta take care of these folks capiche you got it first we'll decide to turn on wow and look dk has his tie backwards oh my goodness the yeti evil dk looks so terrifying with its red eyes okay nine nice we are first okay so we are first and then Detective Peach is next, which is very nice. Then it's DK and Penguin Luigi. Penguin Luigi is so silly. I love Penguin Luigi. What game is Penguin Luigi from? Is that a real power-up? I've never played a game with Penguin Luigi. All right, where's the first star? First star's right over here. Here's the star. Be sure to collect coins as you make your way over here. I'll be waiting for you. Okay, so Toadette is right up there, not super far. I'm wondering if the CPUs are going to buy chomp calls. Should be all set, so let's get started. Okay, everyone, give you your best shot out there. Good luck and have fun. I think we will have fun. These characters look amazing. This, this mod is just beautifully made. A lot of you were saying in the last video where I played with Christmas characters that you really like, oh my goodness, and we got a 10, very nice. Okay, let's see, now then. Ah, oh, this is such a tough choice. Do I want to buy something right now? You know what? Let's get a mushroom. Oh man, but we're so close to the star, so that even if we win- Oh wait, no, but we get plus three for landing, so if we win the mini game, then we can still afford it. Okay, so this should be good. Okay, so let's go over here. Okay, because we have ten points. If we win the mini game, then we can still afford the star. So let's see how this goes. It's quite possible that we'll actually get the star in turn number two. That would be perfect. Okay, Detective Peach passes by. She's in her winter outfit, staying warm. She gets a chomp call. Nice choice. But if I can reach the star before she scares away the star, then I might have a chance of getting it. Okay, what does Evil Yeti DK do? Rolls just a two, lands on a red. Okay, I'm not super worried about him yet. But there might be a bonus star for who lands on the most red, so he's a contender fat. Okay, Penguin Luigi, what do you do? Rolls a seven. Okay, so DK's actually the farthest back, which is nice. Okay, Penguin Luigi wants to go to the lucky space. And what does he get from the lucky space? Seven coins, not bad. So that puts him into first place right now, actually. All right, let's see what our mini game is. Hey, oh, everyone versus DK. Uh oh, which one will we have? Tug of War. Okay, okay, okay. This is gonna be a very, very intense one. Look at how good he looks in that Bowser suit. This is so fitting. Okay, come on, Peach. Guys, 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 Oh man, he's tied with Luigi in first now. What do I do now? I am probably going to pass by the star. What do we even do now? We want a small number. We want to get a one, two, or three so we don't pass by the star because we can't afford this star. Actually, a three would be bad too, so we want a one or two. Uh, five. Oh man. Okay, what do we get on the lucky space? Let's see, we get something nice here. If we get an item bag, that might be nice. 12 coins. Eh, we can afford this star, but like, wh what does it matter if someone can reach it before us? Okay, nobody else can afford it though. Peach rolls a four. Okay, she doesn't use the trump call. Oh, she lands on the lucky space though. How many coins does she get? Or if she gets coins, that is. She gets another trump call. Oh man, what is she going to do with those trump calls? Hey, Evil DK, what are you gonna do? If he gets a small number, that'd be nice. Okay. Does he buy something? What does he buy? Wait, does he also buy a chomp call? Okay, Evil DK, Evil Yeti DK gets a chomp call also. Looks like lots of people really want these chomp calls. And what does he get on the lucky space? Does he get money? Let's see. He gets another chomp call. How many chomp calls? There are four chomp calls in the game right now. This is so intense. The star's just gonna be moving multiple times. Per turn, maybe. Okay, Luigi rolls a four. Okay, let's see. Does he want, okay, he doesn't pay to warp, which is fine. And he goes down there. Oh, I'm gonna be passing by the shop soon too. Okay, let's see. Uh, winning this minigame would be pretty important. 
Okay, let's see. What's the mini game gonna be? Bumper balloon cars. Okay, this is very intense. Okay, let's see how evil Yeti DK will be. Let's see. I'm just gonna stay back. I'm gonna go for him first. Okay, we got him. We got him. We got him. Okay, now it's just me and Peach. Let's go, Peach. What are we gonna do? How are we gonna do this, Peach? Never turn your back on an opponent. <laughs> <laughs> Reindeer Yoshi wins. Oh, I don't know if I finished this thought earlier, but something that I was saying was, in the previous Christmas video, a lot of people were saying that they really liked the Reindeer Yoshi mod. That, that's made by Sergeant Spike. I think all of these mods are actually made by Sergeant Spike. Absolutely amazing mods. So, yeah, we're playing as Reindeer Yoshi now. 23 from the star. You know what, let's just roll normally. I'll save the mushroom. Okay, just a five, not a huge number. Now we're going to be 18 away. Oh wait, are we going to a Bowser spot? I think we're going to a Bowser spot, actually. Let's see. This might actually be good. Hopefully we don't lose too many coins, but it's not super important. Good that it's near the beginning of the game. So funny to see a reindeer Yoshi here. This is the Bowser space. Are you ready to have some fun? Good. Okay, what will it be? What will it be? Bowser minigame. Okay, so, oh, this is actually good because every it's possible that everybody will lose coins. Let's see, which one is it? Oh, wait a minute, what is this? Score 80 points or more. Oh, and we have to twist Bowser's face into that. Okay, let's go. Let's see. That one's down like that. This one's up to the side like that. This one basically covers the pupil like that. No, that should go a bit lower, I think. Let's see, how's that look? Okay, that's pretty good. This one should go basically to the edge like that. How's the nose? The nose is a bit to the side. This is a bit that way, a bit like that. How's that looking? I think that's looking, oh wait a minute. No, oh man, I made the nose really bad. Did we score at least 80? 83, we made it. DK gets 92. I think that means, does that mean that only they lose coins? Peach and Luigi, I'm taking 10 coins now. Wait, okay, Peach has only nine coins. Luigi has 20, so what happens? Uh, okay, okay, so Peach just loses all of her coins. Okay, but I'm worried about DK. Because DK is so close to the star. Peach, you're about to pass by the star and you have no coins. Kind of surprised that she didn't use the chomp call. Well, I guess it doesn't really matter too much because there, it's not like there's anyone that can afford this star that's about to reach it. Okay, what about DK? He can't afford the star, which is great. Okay, he also passes by. Okay, this is actually very nice. Everyone is passing by the star and nobody can afford it, so this is fantastic. Versus space. Uh-oh. Let's see what's going to happen to the coins now. Okay, so DK gets three coins for landing there. Look at how evil he looks with his red eyes. 20. Okay. Okay, so I'm the only person who paid in all 20 coins, so me losing would be the worst. Let's see. Pokey Pummel. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's see. Let's do some mashing. Hopefully we can beat this guy. Let's go. Two. One. Let's go, 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 let's go. Okay, looks like we're winning, looks like we're winning. I think we're winning this one. Okay, not bad. 7.08, didn't beat my best time, but we did good enough there. Okay, I'm just glad we beat DK. DK might even profit from this. I paid in 20 coins, he paid in 15. So let's see how many coins we each get. Let's see. Oh, DK gets only 9. Okay, I get 33. That is amazing. I am so happy with that. That's amazing. Okay. So, DK's coins are nice and low. I'm in a pretty solid first place here. Penguin Luigi has zero coins, zero stars. Poor Penguin Luigi in absolute last place here. Rolls a seven, 10 away from the star. Hey, he might reach the star next turn. He only has three coins. Oh man, I was gonna say, I'm like, is he gonna get a star because he's in last place? He gets a, uh, ah, man. The fool's luck, look at that. Oh man, absolute last place. Gets a star hidden block. Oh my goodness. I was about to say that he might get a star hidden block right before it happened too. Okay, one versus three minigame. What is it? Quick sand cash. Okay. Oh, uh, this means, oh, it's so funny seeing uh, the Rudolph nose on Yoshi right there. Since this is a coin minigame, that means that the others might get a lot of coins actually. Okay. Oh no, I let Peach get that. I shouldn't have let her get that. Let's see, I've got to focus on the money bags. Just got to keep them away from the money bags. The money bags are the most important. Okay, stay away from the money bags, bros. Bros, 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 stay away from the money bags. Okay, let's see, any money bags or no? Oh, I'm doing pretty good at keeping them away here. Yeah, sure, you could have that one. Any money bags? Any more money bags? Anything else? Okay, not bad. They get 13 each, so they've got a few coins, but I definitely lucked out there. 
Okay, so how many do we get? I get 25, they get 13 each. Okay, DK can afford this star. Luigi can almost afford this star, actually, and he already has a star. Man, Luigi, uh, how did he get so lucky? Okay, we're 18 away from the star. The mushroom won't let us reach it, and if we get too close, maybe somebody will use a chomp call. Uh, so, you know what, I think I'll just roll normally again. I think I'll do that. Okay, a nine, that's a nice big number. So we're almost guaranteed a star for the next turn, but you know what, I'll also take a double dice. I think a double dice would be nice in some situations. So now we have the double dice and we have the mushroom. So that could come in handy. Okay, so we're going down this way. And a lucky space! Okay, more coins would be nice. Let's see. Custom dice block or skeleton key would be okay, but skeleton key is super cheap. Okay, we get another mushroom. So, we've got a lot of items, so we might be a contender for the most items used bonus star, which would be cool. Okay, where's Peach going? Rolls a 6k, so she's not landing on the bank, not landing on the Bowser spot. Oh, but she's passing by the shop. I wonder what she'll buy from the shop. Will she buy a third shop call? That'd be hilarious. Spends 3. Okay, so mushroom or key? Mushroom, okay. Now then, do I have to worry about anyone having enough coins to steal a star? Maybe not. DK's probably the closest. Okay, let's see, Peach gets a, thir a third chomp call! It it'd be so funny if she throws away her mushroom for the chomp call. Oh, she throws away the first chomp call. Okay, okay. We've seen a lot of chomp calls in this game. Okay, DK rolls normally, rolls a two. Oh, he's going to a Bowser spot, that's not good. That's not good. Because now we both landed on the same number of Bowser spots, so if there's a bonus star for most Bowser spots, then we would both get it. Okay. Let's see, what is, what is he going to get from the Bowser space? Giving coins to Bowser would be great. Please not Bowser shuffle. Okay, good, 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 good. Just give 10 coins to Bowser. That's perfect. That's perfect. Because DK is very, very good in minigames, as we have seen. Okay, what about Luigi? The fool. How lucky will the fool be? Okay, rolls just a five. So where is he going? Passing by the shop, does he buy something? Spends three coins. Mushroom or key? Oh, he buys a key. Uh, maybe he's gonna steal some coins, steal a star from somebody. Can't afford to steal a star yet, which is good. Okay, and chooses to get a, gets a, or not chooses to get, luckily gets a custom dice block from the Lucky Space, which is a pretty good item, gotta say, it's a pretty good item. Okay, everyone versus DK again. Okay, last time it was everyone versus DK, when it was Tug of War, he won. Title toss, oh man, this is gonna be so hard. Let's see, I don't know if we can win this one. Oh. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Let's go! No! Oh no! I'm so scared! This is such a weird strategy that I'm using, but somehow it is working. Let's see. Because I'm invincible for a bit. Oh no! And then the second one can't hit me. Please survive! Yoshi, please! Oh my goodness, that was so- I was so focused there because every time I thought that I would get knocked out, I wasn't able to jump it, and then he had a second little one come, and I was invincible during that time so he couldn't get me. That worked out amazingly. That was actually pure luck. I played pretty badly there. I'm so surprised that Evil DK couldn't get me there because he was playing well. Okay, now it is daytime. Okay, your turn, Yoshi. Turn number five. Nine away from the star. So, double dice or mushroom? What's better here? You know what, I'm gonna go with the mushroom and I'll hope that we can roll at least a four. Because if we get at least a four, then we have at least a nine, then we can reach the star. Seven, okay, okay, okay. So, good that we use the mushroom. Let's go this way. Now, what do we buy? Ah, oh, that is the question. I'm gonna go with the double dice, though. Hopefully we can get some big numbers. Going to try to get the bonus star for most spaces traveled, and if we get, like, double dice and mushrooms, then that might be able to help us. So let's go this way. And, yeah, let's buy this star, okay. Oh, but you know what? Being in first place after turn five isn't great, because... After turn five, someone between... Someone who's either in second, third, or fourth place will be selected as possibly the winner, and they're given a prize. And it might be like a Boo Bell or something in this level. Oh! Uh, the star's right down there, okay. Uh, so DK and Peach are definitely both closer than me. Yeah, Peach is the closest to it. Very likely that Peach will get it. She is so incredibly close to it. Okay, now do we go this way, or up the other way? Let's see. You know what? I think I'll take a risk. Let's do this. This is something risky. Let's play something a little risky here. Let's pay five coins. So then the Womp is going to move to that side now. Oh, and what is this? It seems like a great place for a party. Yeah, something happens there if you go out at night. I don't think I've ever actually been there, so I don't know what happens. Okay, now what do we get from the lucky spot? Ten coins! Okay, that's nice, because we're full of items, so it's nice that we got some more coins. 
because I'm thinking that maybe the next star will appear up that way. Ah, uh, Peach Roll's just a three, that's so sad. Okay, Lane's on a red space, so she is now a contender for most, uh, for getting the bonus star for most red spaces. DK Roll's only a two, these guys are rolling such small numbers, what's going on? Maybe I should have actually gone the other way, might have been a good choice to go down the other way, actually. Oh, he gets a skeleton DK, so maybe DK wants to actually start to steal some coins or something. What about Luigi? Luigi's someone who he's just like, you figure you're like, ah, oh, look, I'm just a silly guy in a, I'm just a silly guy in a penguin outfit. No one has to worry about me. But then he's the one who's making the real plays over here. Because Luigi's actually the easiest difficulty right now, but he's the best computer right now. Okay, and he gets another custom dice block. So he's got two custom dice blocks and a skeleton key, so I'm a bit worried about him. Okay, bonus minigame. Oh, wait. Everyone versus Peach. I kind of don't want to win this minigame, because if we win this minigame, then DK gets 20 coins. All of us get 20 coins, except for Peach if we win. And if Peach wins, then it's just Peach that gets 20 coins. I'll just try to win it either way. Guess we'll see. Okay, let's hide here. Okay, let's see where next. Oh! I'm surprised DK actually got out. I didn't expect- Oh, man! Oh, now it's up to me. Now, do I want us to lose? Do I want to give Peach the coin? Oh, man! Ah, uh, man. I don't know if this is a good choice right here, what I'm doing. Deciding to win that one. I could have lost that to give the coins to only Peach. I don't know if this is a good choice, what I'm doing here. Oh, Luigi looks so happy as a penguin that wins. Okay, so we all get 20 coins. Hopefully, this isn't a bad choice. Hopefully, that was the smart choice there that we did. Five turns are left. Down to the last five turns! Let's take a look at the current standings! First place, Yoshi! Second, Luigi! Third, Evil DK! And fourth, Peach! What a heat of competition! This is anyone's game! But who will win? Let's hear a prediction for one of our board correspondents! Speaking of predictions, I bet you can predict who we have today! Come on out! Who's it gonna be? Kamek! Or uh, some kind of Magic Koopa. Okay, Peach! Oh! All right, Detective Peach. Oh, they give her a gift of 20 coins. That's quite the nice gift. And her hair goes through her a little bit like that. Now that we're in the home stretch, Blue Space will give you six. Brad will make you lose six. Oh, and the Koopa Bank deposit has increased to five coins. And if two players land on the same space, a duel will begin. Still anyone's game. Just keep trying your best. And don't give up. Okay, now, what in the world do I want to do? Because sometimes this star appears, like, right around here. The star appears in one of these spots sometimes. So the star might be there soon, so I kind of don't even want to use my items. We're 29 away. Hmm, I guess we'll just roll normally. Okay, three. So that brings us to... Oh, right there. Okay, we land right on the Koopa Bank. That's fine, get nine coins. Kind of wishing that we landed on the event panel, because there might be a bonus star for who lands on the most event panels. And I don't think anyone has landed on that yet. Okay, Peach, how far away are you? Nine away, come on. Please reach the star. I want her to reach the star. Please get a four or more. Yes! Yes, yes, yes. Okay, that's actually good. I'm happy that she is buying the star. Because now I'll get to see where the next star is. Unless the star is right in front of me and then DK uses the chomp call. That would be so evil. That would be very, very, very evil if DK did that. We would not want evil DK to do that. Okay, Peach. Detective Peach gets the star. It's nice that uh, I was most afraid of DK, but right now he's in last. Oh no, it's over there. Wait, that's uh, isn't Luigi going that way? It's literally right in front of Luigi. Luigi's about to get a second star. Wait, so now DK using a chomp call wouldn't be too bad of an idea. Let's see, will he use it? Ah, poor Luigi, poor Luigi. The star's right in front of him, but he can't use it. Uh, okay, let's see, where does Toadette move to now? If she moves right in front of me, I would be so happy. That would be perfect. Okay, where does Toadette move to? Ah, uh, not right in front of me. Okay, other end of the map. Okay, luckily, we've got some double dice, we've got some mushrooms, so maybe we could start heading that way. But, yeah, we are pretty far away from it. But we are going to be passing by this shop. DK rolls a 10, nice big number. Now he's only 13 away. And does he buy something from this shop? Let's see. Spends 10 coins, and that is triple dice. So, he might reach the star next turn. Okay, okay. And I've also got to worry about his big numbers because now he is a contender for getting the bonus star for most spaces traveled. And Luigi also gets a 10. What's with everyone in these big numbers? Everyone is getting huge numbers right now. What in the world is happening here? Okay, let's see what minigame we have. Oh yeah, right. Oh, Luigi doesn't buy anything. I'm surprised. Okay, and he lands on a red space. 
I'm so glad that Luigi didn't get that second star. That was a very good use of the chump call by Evil DK there. Okay, now all of us versus Luigi, so he shouldn't be super worried here. Okay, Piranha Pursuit. Look at how Luigi looks on that skateboard, it's so great. I gotta find out what game that is from. What game is it from where uh, you have Penguin, or you have Penguin Luigi? Because I have seen some thumbnails on YouTube where there's a Penguin Luigi and there's like a Penguin Luigi power-up. But I don't know what game it is from. Okay, let's see. Come on, come on, come on. Can we get this Luigi? This Luigi is supposed to be the easiest difficulty. Well, the easiest of the of the CPUs that we're facing. Come on, come on, come on. We're so close. Come on. Let's see. Oh, that was so close. That was so close. Okay, Luigi's almost at the end. Come on, come on, come on. Guys, we got to do better than this. And there we go. Okay, man, it's like when you do catch someone, it's usually very close to the end like that. But... Okay, so we do win that one. All right, so we all get 10 coins for that. Oh, and that puts, uh, that puts Detective Peach into second place now. Four turns are left. We're getting close to finishing the game. It becomes nighttime. Now would be the perfect time to have a skeleton key. I'm kind of sad I didn't buy a skeleton key, because if I had a skeleton key, then I'd be able to pass by here and steal coins from everyone. Okay, so no matter what we roll, it isn't super important, and DK is 13 from the star. So it's very likely that he is going to be getting a star. So you know what? Let's just use a double dice. Why not use a double dice? Let's see where it takes us. Let's use an item. Five and a ten. Okay, so fifteen. Not bad. Pretty big number. And we're just heading down here. Passing by the Koopa Bank. Paying five coins. That's fine. Got a lot of money. Eighty-seven coins. And you know what? Let's see. What else is for sale now? Do I want a custom dice block? You know what? Let's take a custom dice block. Because maybe we'll be able to specifically choose to land on an event panel in some case. Oh, okay, there, okay. Well, uh, I did realize that we'd be landing on an event panel, okay. Because right now, I think we might be the only one that has landed on an event panel. Okay, Peach rolls a four. And the nice thing about landing on event panels is that uh, there might be a bonus star for who lands on the most event panels. So right now, I think that we're the only person who might be able to get that. Oh, a duel between Peach and DK. This is gonna be crazy. Okay, how many coins do you wager, Peach? 19 coins. That's very scary. Who do you guys think will win this one? Peach or Evil D Jedi DK? Let's see. 38 coins are at stake. Who's gonna win this one? Let's see. DK wins. Peach is like, oh, DK, how could you do this to me? DK's like, thumbs up. Let's go, buddy, for me. Okay, so DK is pretty rich now. 54 coins. Is he gonna use his triple dice block? Oh, I am very surprised that he didn't use his triple dice block. Just rolls an 8. Passes by here. I hope so much that Peach uses her chomp call the next turn. Oh, no. Oh, oh, okay, don't unlock. Okay, good. Good. You scared me for a second there, DK. I thought you were gonna maybe try and steal my star or steal a coin or something. Okay, 20 coins! 20 coins! What luck DK has. Okay, Luigi's turn. Penguin Luigi, what are you doing? He uses a custom dice block. Okay, he's gonna... What is he gonna roll? Is he gonna go to a lucky space? Oh, he wants a 10. Okay. Okay, wait a minute. Um... Okay, what does he buy? Spend seven coins on what? A chomp call? Okay, so if he uses his custom dice block next turn, then it's possible that he will reach the start. Don't be another hidden block. Okay, good, good, good. Not another hidden block. Oh, and there aren't very many turns left. There are very few turns left, in fact. Okay, what? Bombs away. Okay, 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 okay. So, this one is possible that everyone will survive and we will all be winners. But, it's possible that that won't happen. Let's see which cannon's shooting. Oh, wait a minute. Can you tell from the cannonballs from which- Can you tell from which cannon's being shot where the cannonballs are going to land or no? How is everyone still surviving? How's everyone still here? Nobody has fallen off yet. That's actually very surprising. Oh, 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 okay, goodbye, Peach. Okay, those guys are dizzy. Let's be careful. Okay, goodbye, Luigi. That was just DK and I. Okay, it looks like we both win this one. We both come in first, so we both get coins. I think Peach doesn't get any coins, but I think Luigi gets some coins for being second here. So, Reindeer Yoshi and Yeti DK both win that. Yeah, Luigi gets two coins, Peach gets none. Okay, only three turns are left, and the star is pretty far away. Others might get to the star before us. Let's just use the double dice. Maybe we'll be able to pass by the shop, buy something nice. Let's see, 10. 
and five. Okay, 15, not bad. We're 21 away from the star. If we had two tens, we'd still be one spot away. Okay, I'm gonna get a skeleton key because maybe we'll be able to use it. And it's good that we're buying it. We'll just buy something cheap. Doesn't really matter, just three coins. Cause there might, oh, if I go this way, I land on the event panel. If I go there, where do I land? Hold on, let's see. I have six left, so let's see. If I go one, two, three, four, five, then I can land here on the lucky space and then I'll be passing by the boo. Or I could land on the regular blue spot here. You know what? I think I'll I think I'll take the risk. I'll go this way. It's a tough choice, but I'm going to go this way. And I'm gonna use the skeleton key. Because there might be a bonus star for most items used. Oh wait, but I could just unlock it and choose to go the other way. That's another option. But I think I'm gonna go down here. I'm going to risk it. Hopefully somebody gets this star before the end of this turn. And hopefully I can stop by the boo. That would be nice too. So let's see. Seven coins from the lucky spot. Not bad, not bad. Don't really care for coins. Don't really care too much for the other items also. Okay, Peach, are you gonna use the chomp call? Oh, Peach, you are so evil using the chomp call. Okay, where is the star going to go? Let's see. So that's pretty close to DK, right? Oh wait, but DK still has a triple dice block. So even if it goes somewhere far away, he might still be able to reach it. Is it going up there? I thought it would go up there because it hasn't been up there yet. So if DK uses the triple dice block, he might actually be able to reach that. That's not super far away from him. Okay, Peach is 27 away, rolls a four. Does she go to the red spot or the other? Oh, oh, I thought she'd go to the red. Okay, she lands on the lucky space. And from the lucky space, she gets... Oh, I was thinking that it would land on item bag. Well, she'd only get one more item if it's item bag. Right, DK, how far away are you? 19 away. Uh, there's a good chance that he reaches it with the triple dice. Let's see, what does he roll? Three. Oh, I, he can't reach it now. Seven and seven. Okay, so that's 17. So he's two away from this star. What does he buy? Spend seven coins, what, chomp call? Oh, warp block. Oh. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. That's something. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. If he does this, can he reach the star? He reaches the star. He can definitely reach the star now. And warp block is scary because I don't want him to swap swaps with me. Okay, it's kind of good that he gets the star. But I'm really hoping that it will be nighttime. I don't know if it becomes nighttime next turn or on the final turn. It'd be amazing if it becomes nighttime next turn. That would be absolutely amazing. I'd be so happy if it became nighttime next turn. Okay, now where's the star going to? Let's see. Back there. Where is this? Is anyone near here? Where is this? It's literally right behind Luigi. And we are so close to it. We might actually... Oh, okay, good, good, good. DK didn't go up that way. I was worried that he would go there. But he wouldn't be able to afford stealing a star, but he would be able to afford stealing coins. Well, stealing coins is free, but he'd be able to steal coins from everybody if he did that. So we might be reaching the star next turn. As long as Luigi doesn't use the trump call. Don't use the trump call, Luigi. Please, 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 I'm begging you. Please, 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 please. Thank goodness, thank you, Luigi. Wait, 40, 42 away from the star? Oh, probably because he doesn't have, wait, he does have a skeleton key, so he can probably go down and take the shortcut. I don't know if we can have a guaranteed way to reach the, uh, I don't know if we can guarantee that we reach the star. Ah, uh, if only he went one more. Actually, because maybe it'll, t maybe it would have turned to daytime after. I guess we'll see. Next turn, though, is going to be a very intense turn for sure. These last two turns are going to be quite interesting. Tipsy turny. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. I wonder how the difficult computer is going to do in this mini game. Let's see how we do against it in comparison. Okay, so we're doing pretty good right now. Okay, let's bring this here. Oh no, I missed a lot there. Now let's see, can we do okay? Okay, we did okay with 15 seconds left. Peach has only one left, one in the corner. DK also, DK's in second. Okay, Peach, are you gonna jump? Oh, Peach didn't jump, just stepped out of the way. Okay, poor Luigi in last place. Still has three crackers left that he didn't destroy. Okay, so we get 10 coins because we won that. Now, does it become nighttime? That is the question. Let's see. If it's nighttime, that's amazing. Does it become nighttime? <gasps> it becomes nighttime. Eight to the star. So, we can steal a star because it's nighttime, so we can pass by the boo, and we can guarantee that we roll at least an eight with the, we can guarantee that we roll at least an eight with a custom dice block, and we can either land on the Koopa Bank or the Lucky Space. You know what? Let's do this. Let's do this because this will just be uh, quite the nice turn for us. Let's put it that way. Let's do this. We'll roll a nine. So here's what we're gonna do. We're passing by here. 
Wait, Spooky Spirits spend time here during the day? <gasps> what? I thought it was like King Boo because King Boo only appears at night, but that ghost only appears during the day. That's so sad. Uh, I was hoping that we'd be able to steal a star. Ah, oh, that's so sad. Because King Boo, up at the top right part of the map, he's only there at night, but I guess that Boo only appears at during the day. That's so weird. I wouldn't have expected that. Okay. All right. Okay, where's the next star then? Okay, so we bought a star. I guess that's fine. But where's the next star? Right over there. Wait, did DK pass by there yet? Or is he about to pass by that? That's... He needs to roll a two to get it. Oh, man, this is not good. I don't like this. I don't like this. Okay, we get these 30 coins, but what does it matter if DK's gonna get another star? Oh, man. Things are really becoming very scary here. Okay, Peach, are you gonna use your chump call? Yes! <laughs> I'm so glad that Peach has all these chump calls. Thank you so much, Princess Peach. Thank you, Princess Peach. I'm very glad that you chose to do that. Thank you, Princess Peach. Now that star moves away from DK. So let's see, where does it move to? Ah, right back to there. Wait, is anyone near the eye? If someone uses the eye, let's see. I don't think anyone's really near the eye. No, nobody's really near the eye. I don't know if anyone can really reach that. I wonder if DK is going to use his chump call. Oh, and Luigi also has a chump call. What if DK uses the chump call and it ends up right in front of him again? Ah, he just uses to roll normally. He rolls a one. Okay, he lands on a red spot. He might be getting the bonus star for most red spaces. What about Luigi? What are you gonna do? Rolls normally, rolls a seven. Wait, does he land on me maybe? Because I landed a, I rolled a nine. Oh, if he went to the left, he might have landed on me because I think I rolled a nine and I think Luigi was two in front of me. So if, oh, and he gets a custom dice block, very nice. So we're going into the final turn after this mini game. This is still very intense. This is literally still anybody's game, depending on, okay, everybody versus DK. Depending on what the bonus stars are, it's all gonna come down to the bonus stars. And our mini game is squared away. Can we squish DK? Can we do it? Can we squish evil DK? Okay, so we are Yoshi. Let's try to squish the DK box over here. Let's see how good he will play. Oh, bro, 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 bro. Come on, come on, we're gonna get you. Peach, come on, come on, Peach. Where's DK going? Let's go! Ah, so close, so close, so close. I thought that he'd maybe get away there. Okay, but he's playing the edges really well right now. Where are you going, bro? Where are you going, bro? They're gonna get you, bro. They're gonna get you, bro. They're getting you, bro. Bro, you're not getting away. You're not getting away, bro. Come on! Peach! How could you do this, Peach? Ah, DK won that. Good job, DK. Well played, DK. We couldn't get him. Evil DK did a fantastic job here. Okay, so he gets 10 coins for that. We all get zero coins. And it's the final turn now. Final turn. Very, very intense moment over here. Okay, I don't think there's really a chance for us to get it. Yeah, 17 away. So we'll just use the mushroom just to have another item used. And maybe to get some more big numbers so that we could possibly get the bonus star for most items travel. Okay, so we can't, or most spaces travel. Let's go this way. Oh, you can't buy an item on the final turn. Okay, lucky space. Whatever we get doesn't really matter. Okay, 12 coins or seven. Okay, we get seven. Doesn't really matter because I think we've got a ton of coins either way. Now what's Peach gonna do? How far away is she? 41 plus away. She uses the triple dice. So she might be a contender for most spaces travel. Let's see, seven, four, and four. Not a huge number, just 15. But let's see where that takes her to. Okay, passes by the bank, pays five coins. I'm surprised at how few stars we all have. I would have expected that maybe we'd have more stars. Okay, not a hidden block, right? Okay, not a hidden block. Okay, what about DK? What are you gonna do? Are you gonna risk using the chomp call? Oh, he chooses to use the custom dice block on the final turn. Okay, and where does he, where does he wanna go? Three, does that bring him to the bank or what? Okay, he gets five coins from the bank. I'm kind of surprised that he didn't risk going to the Bowser space, but on the Bowser space, you might have to give away a star, so that would be a pretty risky thing to do. Okay, Luigi uses a custom dice block. What does he want to roll? Let's see. He wants a 10. Okay, so he also wants a big number. Now then, it's all gonna come down to the bonus stars. We have the most stars, which is very nice, and the most coins, which is very, very nice. So, as long as nobody gets more bonus stars than us, we win. So if we get at least one bonus star, we have a guaranteed win, which is amazing. Okay, Luigi gets 15 coins from the lucky space, and it's a four-player minigame. Our final minigame is a four-player minigame. Let's see what it will be. Mush Pit! Oh, this is so intense for the final minigame. All right, let's see. Who will become giant? Oh, there it is. I've got it. I gotta squish everyone now. Okay, got those guys. 
That's what I was most worried about. Good, but oh, Luigi, Luigi. Oh, I couldn't get Luigi. Oh no. Let's see if I have a shot at getting Luigi. Let me get it. Okay, I got it. All right, all right, that was amazing. Okay, I just sniped the mushroom that time. I wasn't even super focused on breaking the blocks. I just wanted to get the mushroom first. Okay, here we go. Oh man, DK looks so evil. Oh, there's a minute. Great job, everyone. It's time to announce the results. Now who will win it all? First, let's go over the bonuses. First bonus is, if we get at least one bonus, we win. So I hope we get this one. Shopping bonus. Okay, I'm pretty confident that we get this one because we bought so many items. This bonus for the eager player who purchased the most items. And the bonus goes to... Please, Luigi. I mean, please, Yoshi. Yoshi, all right. So we've got three stars. So I think there's no way that anybody can catch up to us. That's pretty amazing. Second bonus we've got is... Eventful bonus. I think that's also for us, the player who landed on the most event spaces. And the bonus goes to... I think that goes to us. This... Win actually went so much better than I thought it would. Okay, because we're not even playing against easy CPUs over here. That brings us to our final announcement. Like, DK's a hard CPU right now. He's supposed to be pretty difficult, but I'm surprised at how unlucky he got. And the winner is... Let's see. So who's in fourth? I don't even know who's in fourth. Who's in fourth? Peach is in fourth. Then Luigi. Okay, DK actually managed to make it to second, though. Pretty good. But... Come on, come on. I chased DK. There we go. Yoshi! Reindeer Yoshi wins. Rudolph the Red-Nosed Yoshi. How beautiful is that? Such an amazing mod. Beautifully made. And this looks so nice. Oh my goodness. Look how cursed that DK looks with the block over there. It looks so evil. It's my pleasure to announce that Yoshi is taking first place. If I have to guess, your winning strategy involved coming out on top in mini games. There was more to it than that. I also made sure to purchase the most items possible. Donkey Kong ends up in second. You gave it your own game real close. Must have been up for a challenge based on all the versus spaces you landed on, and also because you're evil. Third place, Luigi! Kept on fighting throughout! Look how nervous Luigi looks over there. You found more hidden blocks than anyone else! You're right first in luck! Yeah, Luigi got a star from a hidden block. Remember when he was in last with zero stars and zero coins? <laughs> Fourth place goes to Peach! You stuck it through all the way to the end! Peach looks so good here. This just looks like it fits so well with this level. Stop on more blue spaces than anyone! Those coins sure are handy, huh? Too bad there's no bonus star for that! Everyone sure gave it their all! Without further ado, let's check the final results! Alright. That was such a clear win over here. Four stars, 121 coins, and if it was daytime on the final turn, then we would have been able to steal another star. And I probably would have stolen from Donkey Kong, so he would have had zero and I would have had five. Yeah, and we definitely would have gotten the bonus star for most spaces traveled because... Yeah, all those items that we used really came in handy. We had most items bought, most items used, most spaces traveled. DK would have gotten the bonus star for most red spaces. I would have gotten the bonus star for most event spaces. I only landed on one, so that's kind of funny. And, oh, DK and I would have tied for uh, Bowser spaces. That's surprising. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you all have an amazing day ahead of you. And take care, everybody.